Hey guys, how's it been going? This is Jay, sir. So, during the last few days, I built a Chrome extension called Deeper Dive, uh, which enhances the uh, homepage of React, which is the React Dev. Um, if you're interested, please go to my blog or just search Deeper Dive directly on the web store. Uh, yeah, you can install from there. So what it does it solve? Uh, the problem is um, I always um, go to React Dev, the homepage of React, to find the single source of truth about React, like the API for references, stuff like that. But um, yeah, I think React team is doing a great job to make it beginner friendly. And uh, I think the philosophy is you don't need to understand how it works. Um, yeah, it is not required. Uh, but uh, we can still build great uh, web apps without understanding its internals, right? That's the philosophy, and it, I think it works pretty well. And they're trying hard to, uh, to continue um, this path. Uh, but sometimes I find it um, very hard to, for me to find the uh, materials that helps me understand internals. Well, I, I'm just a curious person. I, I just want to know how it works. Um, but there's no such thing. Uh, we have to search the internet and uh, it's our it, uh, it's our own responsibility to tell if it's uh, valuable or not, right? Um, so that's the thing. And we want some source of truth, but it's not there. Um, so I built this deeper dive Chrome extension that will add the links to external materials, which will explain the topics a little deeper. So I, name, I named the Chrome extension uh, Deeper Dive. Um, yeah, so after you uh, install the extension and then you go to the React Dev, it will um, enhance it. Like for hooks, uh, you will see these new icons. This is a diver icon here. Um, and uh, in the page, you will uh, see like for uh, let's go to the uh, notorious one use effect and this is the contents from the react dev but there is a section called deeper dive add to the icon to uh, make it easier to distinguish the contents added or intrinsic from this website and I've add a few links here sorry most of the links are to my blogs uh, for now uh, and also add one from the Dan sensei uh, a complete guide to use effect. I think that it's really worth reading. And uh, yeah, that's the example. Like uh, the recently, what I uh, tried to figure out is the use optimistic. Yeah, uh, you can see I add a link. How does it work internally? Yeah, that's basically it. Um, so this allows us to like attach the uh, advanced topics directly to the React Dev and. Uh, Every time you want to search something, you just go to React Dev and uh, the links are there. You don't need to go to the uh, search or something. Um, uh, uh, yeah, you might be like uh, wondering, hey, well, why why do you put your blocks there? Uh, this just for now. Uh, and I actually put it into uh, the GitHub. It's open source. Um, the, the code is pretty simple. Just a, a map from the uh, path to some external links. Uh, yeah, so far I put a few links like this. Uh, like there's one for use effect, which is that um, word use effect, use effect. Sorry, it's here. Yeah, this one is to Dan Sensei. Um, like if you have better links, um, you can just uh, create a pull request and uh, I possibly would just accept it if it's uh, uh, valuable. And also if you have better ideas of how we can enhance this website of React Dev, uh, you can also put, create a pull request. Well, I don't want it to be too intrusive, um, but yeah, if you have a better ideas, leave an issue or, uh, yeah, talk with me. Uh, let's make it better. Cool, and that's it.